Hey guys, welcome back to some more Cricket 19 and part 12 of our World Cup playthrough with England. Today we finish off the match against the West Indies. We require another 71 to win. Joe Root's going along very nicely on 72 from 67. Owen Morgan contributed nicely with that 56. And we've also got Ben Stokes at the crease. So 25 overs to go. Can we do it? I think we probably can. As you can see, we only really need three and over from this point. Oh! Well, Stokes is out. That was a good direct hit, that. I thought the, the bowler wasn't going for it, but he did. He just sort of teleported to it. And Stokes has gone for three. So... Bit of an awful start to the episode, but uh, we've still got Joe Root here, which is good. That's better. Got past the ball there this time. And a single taken. Ali about to face their first ball. Along the ground. Might get two here. Needs to be on target. One wicket falls in that over. 176 for five. Bit Hold of a shame that we lost. The attack. Uh, ben Stokes in that over, but you know, like for like replacement in Ali. Yes. Very good lower order batsman. I know my good friend TIJ, he fancies Ali as an opener for the test side. Yes. And they get a single there. the risk at this stage. Still struggle with them ones where it's uh, pitch short, but doesn't really matter. And then the other 180 for five. 63 more runs required for the victory. That's a lovely shot. That might go for four. It will. And that'll just relieve the pressure a little bit. It's been a while since we'd had a boundary. Route now into the 80s. Yep. Go for that same gap. Just the two from it. Two runs added. Yeah, yeah. 
Whizzes past the off stump. Great ball. Chance here. That could have been out, but we're okay. Need to direct hit. Go for the quick single. Well, that was another good over. Frustration will be growing for the batsman. Nine for five. Didn't like the look Wide of that ball. one. No shot offered. It's up the 190. Something we employed a lot when we were bowling. That's going to be four wides again. Very poor bowling, really. Just the one. And that's a single. Yes. Well, we've gone for it. And that's going to be four. four. Went a bit closer to the fielder than I would have liked, but full toss gets a treatment. Four runs. 200 up. Yep, yep. Yeah, good shot. And through for one. I'd love to get Rooter's sentry here. Yep. England. Two or four for five, then. With how that over went. The right arm medium bowler is coming into the attack from the scoreboard end. He lets that go through to the keeper. Very nice there from Holder. They take the single. Gone for it, and it's six. Won't like that at all. Wonderful shot from Joe Root. Full toss, getting the full treatment. I went over the ropes. First six of the innings. Moves in uh, the nineties now. And a single. Give away a bit too well, 30 much over's here. gone. 213 for five. Drinks come out via Chris Walks. Joru definitely in need of the drink. It's been playing brilliantly. 
has worked very, very hard for these runs. So four away now. Let's that go through to the keeper. So wide that. That's the last thing that the Windies can afford, really. Winning. Plays that nicely along the ground. Just a lack of concentration there. Just struggling to get a bat on ball in this over. Yeah, yeah. And we managed to get a single. I thought the umpire was a fielder there, never mind. Um, 216 for 5 now. This bowler knows how to give the ball an almighty tweak. Let's see how they go. This could be out. Well, direct hit there and Root was gone. But he's okay. Well, I've gone for it, but I think it's going to be out. Oh no, it's dropped. Or oh, he didn't pick it up. I don't know what. We nice moves on to 99. We'll and we won't be going for a shot like that again. <laughs> they got Butler out. Can't afford it. Yep. Getting Joe out. Oh, not quite. Come on, Joe. Yep. It's away, and that's going to be the sentry for Joe Root. Absolutely brilliant. I'm proud of enjoyed this one. A hundred runs on the board, and he's batted well. So the big one hundred. up here in the commentary box joining me now is james taylor thanks lats good to be back the right arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the bridge end yes. oh what a stop what a wonderful stop reach, but the umpire doesn't signal why That's through the gap. That's going to be four magnificent runs for Moali. The batsmen have put on 50 here. Good effort. Apparently that's a 50 partnership. Catch. And they get through for one. in the air could be out yeah. I think it is close. top edge yeah you can see edge on the helmet and the wicket keeper came and collected 
Wonderful innings though from Joe Root. 101 has virtually won us this match. We just need Plunkett to go and do the job the now. The non in. Liam Plunkett comes to the wicket. 2-2-6 two, two, six for 6. One run there. Well, that's just no shot offered. Ridiculously wide. Plunkett is getting ready to face the next ball. That was another good over. This will be growing the frustration of the batsman. Well, there we go. This bowler really can get these spinning a Chris long way. Gale. Let's see how they go. And here he comes with his part time off spin. Yeah! Huge appeal. Not out the decision. A life for the batsman, perhaps. Well, are they going to appeal it? No. Or review it, I should say. Wait. Oh, what a stop. What a stop. plays that along the ground. They like it. Loud appeal. Yeah! What? The captain making the change of the bowlers and pays so dividends what immediately. Is that, is that the run out? And great bowling. Yeah, I think it is. I think Ali's gone. Run out, yep. Well, we need to be careful now. <laughs> we still need 14 to win here. And only three wickets in hand. I, I thought he'd given LBW out and I knew that we'd hit it with the bat. But uh, it was given run out. And I One think just to chill to the finish now. Poor Liam Plunk, it still hasn't got off the mark. It still hasn't. Deserve the wicket. He is putting a fine over. Good over from Chris Gale, you would have to say. 230 for seven. Swing and a miss. The batsman misjudging that one. Yeah, that's a good shot. Only the one though. Twelve to win. Yep. He'll get two for that. Great shot. And Plunkett finally off the mark with that two there. Waiting. Roach has done Under the other two thirty three for seven.
This should be close. And through for one. Let's that go through to the keeper. Definitely starting to feel a little bit nervous. Oh my god, Rashid didn't run very quickly. We're now eight down. Rashid gone for three. Bit of a task for the new batsman here. Trying to turn this innings around after a steady flow of wickets in recent overs. Edged. And that was an edge. Ball. You couldn't do much against that bowling. Nice over. Wow. The right arm Only seven to win. To bowl from the bridge end. Yep. That's a great shot from Plunkett. That relieves the pressure a little bit Could with the two runs. And two runs added to the scoreboard. Waiting. Plays that nicely along the ground. Well, we've gone for it, and that's going to be four. And that's four. Risky, but there wasn't much chance. As long as we timed it fairly well, it was always going to go over that infield and four runs there. Three to win now. Well, apologies about that, guys. We had the screen tear again. I'm not sure whether you got to see the win and runs. But uh, Liam Plunkett hit a beautiful shot uh, for four there at the end. And uh, we win by two wickets in the end. So it was a little bit, uh, I don't know, nerve-wracking at the end. But we did it in 37 overs. We allowed ourselves to have a bit of a go towards the end. Uh, but Morn Ali gets man of the match for his 4 for 63 in his 20 runs in the uh, the end. But Joe Root with that sentry, very, very good indeed. And uh, we've won four out of four. Goodness me, would you have believed that uh, at the start of this tournament when we just narrowly beat South Africa um, at, the, at the death of... In, uh, in that match. I don't know what's going on there. Okay. But anyway. Um, we've now got Sri Lanka coming up next at Headingley. Which is going to be uh, fun. Uh, and we are now top of the table. Australia in second there. Pakistan third. India fourth. Bangladesh in fifth. Afghanistan sixth. New Zealand seventh. South Africa eighth. I'm um, assuming the West Indies uh, in ninth. And Sri Lanka intense so it should hopefully be our easiest game yet but you can pretty much guarantee that is not going to be the case but if you've enjoyed that make sure you leave a like down below really does um mean a lot for me it really does help out the channel as well and yeah i hope you guys are having a wonderful day thanks for watching and goodbye